Hey guys, welcome back to the vlogs. I'm um, just down here at Pass It On Clothing. First time I'm gonna check it out, but the boys come here a lot. We've got Gemin Fix Barker, Normie, Simi. Hello. We'll go see what's happening down here. Roll the intro. Hey, what's up? My name's Isaac, but you can call me Ice. These are my friends, Chico and Normie. We met through footy, we live together, travel together, party together, and even got a little bit of trouble together. You sweet. You know the rules started as a joke, we turned it into a hashtag, and now we're a clothing business. So now you know our backstory, these vlogs are about our journey. Good. Kenny. So I'm like, bro, I've got to pick up oh, every hand in these dogs these days. How you say? Oh, good. How are you? Oh, no, is that Isaac? He's making his appearance. Hey, Hello, brother. Brother. Oh, yeah. made it. I finally oh, made it. Hey guys, welcome back to the vlogs. We're down here at Pass It On Clothing. This is where Chico and Normie have been coming for the last year. Uh, to be honest, it's my first time here. I've never come down. Thought, that, thought I'd come down and check it out. I know there's kind of a weird stigma about filming about charity and stuff, but uh, we've been donating clothes to these guys for a long, long time, and I know it's something that Chico and Normie are really passionate about. So let's go check it out, see what's happening. Can't stop. How long have you been doing this for? But I've been close to a year now, eh? Yeah. How time's <laughs> flying. <laughs> nah, this, so this is um, this is where it's normally set up, but with all the construction site there, there's normally um so yeah, they go in and do um all their washing and, and they get to do their dryers there. They come down to Christmas thing, pick out some more clothes. Yep. Right. <laughs> and then um they just had a barbecue before down there, but Usually our van will come up later and they'll bring like KFC and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. Everyone will line up, but yeah, this is where we normally do it every week down here. Everyone comes in, there's a men's and women's section. Yeah. Come in and choose some clothes and then get a feed and I think a lot of them know each other from around here anyway, so they all um they all know each other and help each other out. Yeah. Hello, how you going? Good? Good, yeah. Oh, hey, how you been? Hey, been? Keep it cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. how's that? Yeah. Not going to do good, are they? We're caught up now, mate. Hey, mate, you see? Oh, mate, we've caught you. Yes. I know. Mate, we've got the Tigers on Saturday night, mate. We'll give it an empty. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. How have you been up there? Which sharks, mate? This mess sounds like it. I can't wait to be you in three weeks, Sharks. Yeah. Uh, 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 lucky, though. Ah. Uh, Lucky enough to team out, we still virgin. <laughs> <laughs> Dead set, Johnny Barker loves doing nothing and just coming with <laughs> Johnny Barker, hey, are you on the tools, bro, or what? Oh, hey, I'm just going to listen to this bloke over here trying to tell me Canberra's going to play Manly in the grand final. <laughs> Not the fake laugh. <laughs> Oi, 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 oi. What's your pick, Jordan? Oh, the heels, man. Pick of the day. Pick of the day. Um, oh, the the uh, vintage, the vintage chucks, man. No laces. Can't it's lose. Simple, simple. <laughs> White socks. <laughs> oh, pick? pick of the day, norms. Yeah, bro. Oh, the Joey specials. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, here he is. Who do you boy support? Uh, <laughs> I'm a bulldog. Who's yeah, your favourite dogs player? Who's my favourite dog to play? Uh, mine are in the past, mate. Who was it? Oh, Terry Lamb, Steve Mortimer. Good score a try, eh? Yeah. Uh, They're back in my time. Those what are you on the news? Got Maloney's. Oh, I'm just looking to see. Maloney's suspended. Hey, yeah, good, suspended. eh? Good, eh? Yep. That's good, eh? Yeah, for tripping, mate. For tripping. Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's been, been suspended, <laughs> mate. <laughs> so, should, eh? He's trying to trip him up. Maloney Gildy. Well, I don't know if he's. One bloke said he was only. Are you just. Him a minute ago. That was That's a trick. Oh, shit, he won a comp. He won a comp with this one. Chill is all the time. Does he? Yeah. Oh, yeah. He picks it up. Casanova or yeah. pass it on, really. Oh, yeah. Any dogs lately? Can I put him up? I have a photo of him. What? No, I didn't. No, no. I'm not getting me on that. <laughs> <laughs> Who was who's this Wait, bloke? No, nah, he's mate. Nah. No, yeah. Oh, yeah, we, we, yeah, he's mate. Oh, yeah, oh, that's alright. Hello, nah, no. one. <laughs> he got girls, eh? Oh, yeah, he's bar. Picked up these two, eh? Just chucked to No, you did not. <laughs> Reminds me of you. Reminds me of you. <laughs> Oi, 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 oi. Oi, proper cracking up, eh? It just follows him. It's just following around. Bah, proper. Tell us the truth, please. I ain't much dog, Casanova. Me and Romeo ain't never been friends. Can't you see how much I'm really loving? Gonna sing. 
gets to you time and time again. You like Dylan? I'm oh, him. Yeah. I like him actually. He's a really fun, last polite bloke, eh? Hey? Yeah, really nice. So yeah. I met him last week. Real polite. Going Might be going. If we win tickets from the club, that is. Oh, so the Tigers. Leagues Club. My yeah. For their like monthly giveaway. Tigers. Where's Tigers? Tigers are going to get flogged. Oh, yeah. Who's your favourite player, Dal? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. big Dal. Dal. Hook up with a straight back. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Okay, this one in here. Sorry, mate. There's white one in there, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so that's just my first time down there, but you know what flipped me out? But they're just normal people, yeah. eh? So what do you think they are? Oh, I don't know. Then once you can get their eyes up, they just start having a normal conversation with you. And just have some, all they do is just talk footy and a bit of banter. Yeah. And girls. Same uh, as this. Same as this fella. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, just finished up at Pass It On Glade. It was actually pretty good, eh, to be honest. I didn't really know what to expect for it being my first time, but sort of once you get in a conversation with them, you just feel like you're having a chat with just normal people, and the boys are trying to take the piss out of me and take the piss out of Normie, and sort of just talking about football, talking about chasing girls. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, didn't really get it and it's good to sort of have a chat with Chris as well Like he's sort of been doing this for maybe three four years and he's trying to make moves and make plans to help it grow And but he said it feels like there's a lot of pressure on him because can't get to take them to footy games and um, clothes and stuff like that, so They're sort of getting up to doing a hundred thousand pieces of clothing pretty soon, so it's pretty exciting But off to Gary V tomorrow. See you guys in. Ah. Hey, welcome to Sydney. Standard Sydney driver trying to Sydney, this is no, you won't be getting in. No, welcome to Sydney. People trying to cut in line. No, you won't be getting in here. Look at those ones right up close. Just in those little situations, there, who has the least, whoever has the least expensive car has a right of way because they're not scared to get it banged. Let's go. <laughs> about to go see Gary V today, which I'm pretty excited about. Um, if you follow me for any amount of time, you know Gary V's my guy. Everything I say is pretty much the same. Shit he says. Just in a different tone, we started vlogging. Just put it this way, essentially the way we put YKTR up is because of what he said and what he said to do. So, um, beating my account and Danny here, become friends now, so we're gonna do this little conference together and paid extra to do a little one-on-one -on -one fighter with him, so that'll be interesting. But I think you'll have cameras in there, so I'm just gonna do my best. Let's go. Hey guys, back in the office now. Pretty crazy day yesterday. Didn't really uh, try and vlog or try and film. Just sort of wanted to be present in the moment and try and learn as much as possible. But let me get deep for a second. Yeah, yesterday was a pretty crazy day for me, to be honest. Haven't been that excited for a long, long time. Um, I've done a lot of cool things in life and traveled to a lot of cool places and met a lot of cool people. But I'll definitely remember that because the w I feel like you remember people that have done so much for you. Um, there's probably about two times in my, since I've started a business, there's probably two times that I've had sort of full circle moments. The first one was, I seen Taku Beats, a photographer, take a photo one time in Hong Kong. And I was really inspired by that and made me pick up a camera, sort of like what Kalen does now. He's obviously a lot better photographer than me now, but um, that was sort of my sort of vibe at the start. I was really into photography and... And that's what inspired me to pick up a camera, then that transferred into vlogging, which combined with reading books. I sort of had all the tools there to start a business, especially like a clothing business. And I got there in Hong Kong that time and I remember going shit, like it made me sort of like reflect on the full circle type vibe. The second time was yesterday, like Gary V, um, if you follow me, you know I love him. I, you, I, I pretty much say the same things he says in a different tone. Um, like everything, this this whole office, like this whole office has kind of been built off the back of everything he's taught. Obviously, there's a lot of execution involved in that, and a lot of that's on me. But it's just really cool to sort of see him speak live for one. But the other thing is sort of like I paid an extra to have the photo with him, but um, I just wanted to go up and sort of like look him in the eye, shake his hand, and say thank you and. I don't really get nervous around people, but I got nervous in that little part because I knew I only had like 10, 20 seconds. And I sort of just quickly rambled out everything I've done um, and how we've grown and started a podcast and vlogs. And he said, oh, I'm super proud of you. And he goes, oh, that makes me happy, that makes me proud. And he goes, just go wider and deeper. So what that means is you need more people to like know who we are or know who I am and go deeper. What deeper means is just double down on what's working, whether it's more vlogs, more podcasts, just trying to provide more, double the value. So that was a sort of advice for me. It was cool. It was sort of cool just to, uh, yeah, it's cool. Cool to meet someone that you look up to and someone that's changed your life so much and 
like I'm involved in three, four businesses now and we'll probably get involved in a few more in the next year or two. Just doing what he's taught me to do by watching vlogs and trying to learn and trying to put it into action. So yeah, it was a cool time. So hope you appreciate that. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time. For this life I cannot change In the hills, deep off in the main Eminem, sweet like candy